Thank you. Hello, people of the world. This is Minato, and I'm going to show you how to make a techno beat in the kitchen. Cause yeah, whatever. Only with presets, cause it's fast. Okay. We start with the kick. Tempo is one to three. One, two, three, four. Four by four kick better normal. We choose a random note to start the track. E is good. Uh, the ending is good, the K is cool, as I said, I like it. We're gonna choose the trusty old 808. As you see, I grab it from the packs. You should all have it in your cracked copy of Ableton, Coral Library, Drum Hits, blah blah blah. Now we get 909. 808 is for the hi-hats. Let's make the hi-hat pattern really fast. One with low velocity, the other with high velocity, so you get more rhythm. This is the disco pattern, you know, like that. Aha, fucking disco. I like disco. I will boost the highs. Not the snare, let's see. Too large. Make it shorter. Let's make it brighter. Let's make the bass line. I'm gonna just use the the famous silent one by Team Arcade. <laughs> We're gonna go to book a bass on the number two, as I said, only presets, no synthesis here. Book a <laughs> techno, more techno, not so much techno, kind of techno. Perfect techno. Average techno. And let's make a sequence. Anything goes here. I, mean, I like to make this so the bass doesn't clash with the kick. This is very important. On this one, I cut the lows, and on this one, I cut the mid and high frequencies. Frequency, and on this one, we're gonna put an LFO tool. I know LFO tool does this automatically, but yeah. I'm old school, I guess. So now we have something like this. 